Welcome. Now we're going to know how we are going to deploy this um, this model. We, I mean, this application, right? So now, so far, we've done it um, deploying it using Flask in our local um, system, right? This is a local Flask API that we have created. What I want us to do is to um, is to also be able to deploy this in the cloud, right? And we're going to use Heroku for that. Okay. So um, first of all, make sure that you you push all the code i mean this this file that we've created right this um this netflix movie recommender a folder that we've created we need to push everything to um we need to make sure that we put everything to to github okay before we can continue with that so i'm going to go to github i'm sure by now you should have a github account but if you don't have a github account you can easily create one and i've logged in already so that's why you've seen this over here but if it's not um, created one, you're just going to let me see this one here in incognito github, right? Right, go to github over here, github.com. Right, you just have to create an account over here, right? You just go to sign up over here. Um, I have an account already, so I'm not going to go through that. And I'm sure with, uh, with regards to the previous tutorial, you already know how to create this account and then push your code, right? So let me, um, one thing that we're going to do over here is to go to this plus sign and then create a new repository, right? We've done this um, in the previous tutorial, so I'm sure you're familiar with this, right? I'm just going to name it as Netflix Recommender, Recommender System, right? Something like that, right? Netflix Recommender System and, um, and Deployment. Maybe I'll just do it like that, all right? Maybe something like that. Um, you can add description that you want, right? Deploying. A recommender, whatever, I mean, that you want. Come on. De deploying a recommender system in the Heroku cloud environment, right? So, I mean, depending on the description that you want to give over here, make sure that it's public and then add readme. And then uh, you can just create a repository. That's all, right? Click, click on this creating a repository. That's that's it. That's the only thing that you want. Now I'm going to bring all of the, um, all of the files, right? So what I'm going to do is this, I'm going to make sure that they are side by side like that. You can, you can, I mean, let me even get rid of this. And then go here. You can just click on add file over here and then upload file, right? That is also going to work, right? If you come here, it's going to come here and then choose file. Okay. And then you go to wherever your file is, right? I want to use this one. You can just do it this way. The only thing is that when you're doing it this way, it's going to leave out the folders, right? And then pick this one. That's why I always want them to be side by side like that, right? So. Let me just push this one again here. Now, um, let me open this one and then I'm going to copy whatever files that I have over here. I'm just going to do control A, right? To so select all of them and then drag and drop them here. That's it. Let me close this one, right? So it's going to load all of them for me. So I just sit and watch. Okay, so now um, once everything is done, what you can do is this, just commit, right? Commit the changes and then you are done, all right? Okay, so now you can see that you have all the files over here. You have every single file that you created. You have all of them over here, static, templates, proc file and everything, right? Now, what we're going to do is, um, now you go to Heroku, right? You go to Heroku. Right. If you don't have an account, you create. I'm sure by now you should have an account because we've been using this platform over and over again. Right. So you just go there. All right. So you, you just uh, you can just sign in over here. Okay. Now you just accept this. Once you come here, you can just go here and then create a new app or you can just click on it over here, create a new app, that's it. 
then you give it a name so maybe um netflix i'm just going to it should be small letters um netflix or maybe Netflix. if the name is not there you just you can just change it right recommender app okay now i see that this one is available so i'm just going to create app Now, um, when you come here, um, the most important thing is that you're going to choose the deployment method that you want, right? Um, either you can use Heroku Git or, I mean, you can use container registry. But what I want you to use over here is the GitHub. That's why we committed our code to GitHub, right? So you click on GitHub over here. And then when you do that, you click on connect to GitHub, right? Now it's going to connect to your GitHub account. And then um, show, I mean, you can now choose the repository that you want to connect. Now you see that it's connected, right? This is my um, GitHub account, right? It's connected over here. Now the repository name, right? Now, if you go back here, right? The this is the repository name. You just copy it like this. It should be exactly as, as, as that. And because it's going to search for that particular name, right? Now, if you do that, you see that it's there, right? Now you click on connect. It has been able to search it. So you click on connect and it's going to do it for you. It's going to connect for you. Now, once that is done, it's now connected, right? It's, it's now connected. Once um, this one, you see that it's connected over here. You can disconnect if you want. And then um, here, you see that we have to choose a branch to deploy, right? It should be the main branch. So you leave it like that, right? And then here you can enable um, automatic deploys. If you enable this one, any changes that you're going to do um, in GitHub later on is going to reflect respectively. All right, so um, you can enable or you can just leave it, right? Let me just enable it. Then um, the final step is to deploy um, branch. So you just click on that and then wait for it to finish deploying. Okay, so it's going to do it. You can see it over here that it's, it's working, right? You can see it over here that it's working. So we just wait for some time for it to finish. Okay, so now once you see that your app was successfully deployed and then you are done, okay, everything works fine. You can just click on this um, view app, right? When you click on that, it's going to open this, um, you see that's here, right? So now everything is done, you've been able to, I mean, you've been able to deploy successfully, right? So you can see that all the changes that we did are here, right? Remember, we changed the search to enter, we changed the name here to Frank, and this, I mean, everything works fine. Now, if you search for anything here, um, maybe we search for, let me just start typing, maybe suggestions will come. Yeah, let me search for whatever. I don't know what <laughs> movie is this, but now you see, what, this is what we put over there, right? Is, I mean, the loading sign, you see that is there. Everything works fine. Now we have, we have a URL that we can share to anyone anywhere in the world so that they can use our app, right? So um, now everything works very, very fine, right? Everything works fine. If we click on it, you can see that the suggestions are there. You can see that we have your reviews and the status of the review there. We see that um, recommendations are also working very, very fine for us. Right? You can click on any of them over here and then um, that also works very fine, right? So I'm sure you, you love this app and uh, you're going to do a lot of things with it. I mean, use the template, manipulate it the way you want and then uh, build something, I mean, even more powerful than what you have seen, all right? Um, I hope you loved it and uh, you give, uh, I mean, a good review and then a good um, rating and comment, review comment to this course, right? I uh, hope to see your review, hope to see your comment in this course. Have a nice day.